Well, it, it was a party. I didn't really keep track of the time. Do you remember Meef turning up? Of course. Drunk? Totally sloshed. Yeah, she made a big fuss, not being allowed in, didn't she, Dawn? Uh, are you still questioning people? It's the little details that add up. Did you see any drug use there? No, oh, well, it was a bright shine party. Paracetamol is the only drug our people use. Dawn? No, none at all. What about Maeve? Have you seen her take recreational drugs? Do I need a lawyer? Oh, it's a yes or no question, Dawn. No, I haven't. Do you need anything else from me? Or... I'd like to speak to Cassie at some point. She's still very upset, crying 24-7. I understand. Logan, can we chat later today? Just go over your statement. No. No, no, you enjoy a break. We'll catch up later. Sure. I might bring her in tomorrow, see how she feels. What are you doing? Oh, TK wants a Christmas chair in the children's ward. Costumes, brazies. But, um, even I'm struggling to smile. Mm. Well, Christmas is Dawn's thing. Get her involved. Uh, yeah, it is, but how did you know that? Oh, I can just tell. Well, I, I've still got a lot of vacancies, so I need two angels over what? Bethlehem, a shepherd, and three wise Well, women. I bags the angel. A uh, bags the shepherd? Oh! You guys are keen? Yeah, of course. Yeah, anything about doom and gloom and murder investigations. So you think it's murder? Well, yeah, it feels like it could but be. But don't spread nasty rumours, Dawn. It's dangerous. OK, well, see you guys tomorrow. Uh, we got the call out, turned up, and Harper, I mean, Dr Whitley, was doing CPR the whole time. So. Correct. I understand you are put on stress leave. Uh, yeah, I'm back on deck now. We'll see about that. Is it the trauma of Wilder's death, young teenage boy? Uh, that, the fires, mass workload, I couldn't keep up. Did you notice anything odd at the poolside in the house? No, I was just focused on my patient. Nothing else mattered. All right, thanks for that, Logan. TK. Thank you. You're supposed to be on leave. I got the all clear from my manager. Oh, did you now? Yeah, light duties only, restock in the amber, maintenance on the gear. What about the counselling sessions? Yeah, she's great. And she wants me to talk to a friend too, you know? Like, deep and meaningful, it's not just about the weather. <laughs> Who was that friend? Uh, that would be Dawny Dawn. A uh, ray of sunshine she is. Yeah, well, Logan's getting really good at cheering and opening his heart, you know? Well, you guys keep it up. Oh, thanks for covering my eyes. You are not getting away with this. We're having those deep and meaningfuls today. <laughs> He's feeling... He doing okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's nice just hanging out with you guys, being normal. Oh, that's the way. Hey, DK. Place is looking good, Dawn. Oh, check it out. It's a Christmas pie. No meat or anything, just fruit and stuff. Okay. Help yourself. <laughs> oh, thank you. Have you ever seen one? Yeah. <laughs> Everyone in the country knew, except Logan. Hey, be nice. No, don't worry, Dawn. No one can stop my good day vibes. Ah. See, he's doing well under my counselling sessions. Mm, it's all about helping and giving. Yeah, he's been talking to randoms. Oh, really? What? Yeah, I uh, saw a couple on the side of the street, had a chat and gave him 20 bucks. Or uh, I wasn't supposed to say that, but... Why not? Well, giving should be on the down low. But just gave me great buzz, you know? <laughs> no, I love this thing. <laughs> the kids walk in there, mm -hmm. come around here, yep. or get pushed in a wheelchair, and then they have their photo with... Santa. Oh, 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 hi, Maeve. Wow, you gave Justine a bit of a fright there. I'm, I'm glad I caught you, actually. Well, does she had sweatshirt? Where did you get this? Oh, it was in Cassie's room. I knew it wasn't hers. Well, it used to be mine, um, but he stole it. He'd always went to bed, never put it in the wash. It used to drive me mad, but... Oh. <laughs> it still smells like him. I don't want to make this all about me, but um, I hope one day that we can be friends. I know it's a lot to ask, but uh, I know Cassie would really like that, and so would I. You don't have to say anything, just think about it when you have some time. All right, back soon. Wow, that was unexpected.
I mean, maybe I misjudged her. I know we'll never see eye to eye on pretty much anything, but that was a really nice thing to do. She's a good person. Is she, though? What? Look, I don't want to add to your pain. But what? Dawn, you're freaking me out. How did Justin react when she found out that Cassie lost her virginity to Wilder? Uh, she went off her nut. Was she vicious? Yeah. Why are you talking like this? Detective Kelly, he keeps asking me questions about you. Again? But I think he should be asking questions about someone else. Because everyone loved Wilder, right? Family, friends, Cassie, Scott, the Bright Shiners. Everyone except for... Justine. Yeah. And I mean, it's just a silly theory that someone gave him those drugs that night. And I know that it sure as hell wasn't you. Call her. You've got her number. Hey, why don't we go outside, get a breath of fresh air? And... You're right, Dawn. It all adds up. It all adds up to Justine. No, it's just a theory at this point. Please, don't... Apparently, TK's organizing Christmas. What did you fabulous? do to Wilder? What? Thought you could just bring me an old sweatshirt and I'd get all sentimental and sad, and then I wouldn't see what you really are. I don't know what you're talking about. You gave him ketamine. What? Well, because he ruined your precious daughter. Took her virginity. Oh, babe, I didn't mean for you. Made her dirty and ungodly. I forgave No, him. you didn't. You got him high as a kite. Just to make him look bad in front of everyone. Where would I get street drugs from, Maeve? That's your territory. You're the drunken druggie. Everyone oh, knows it. Justin, that's... No, 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 no. You expect me to just stand here and take this? This is slander. I felt sorry for Wilder, being raised by lesbians, no family structure in the home. You couldn't even keep your marriage together on the way to divorce. Shut your mouth! Hey, hey, hey. Don't come near me! There you go, lashing out at everyone again, blaming everyone but yourself! Ah! Ah! Mail, my son! I know you did! Ah! Ah!